Byron thinks I'm crazy, but I'm not ready for this. It's gonna end the 100 baby challenge. I don't know what this face is. It's like I stole my brother's bed and now I'm gonna stare at you while you eat. We sadly moved out all of the children except for True. Three boys now live in our old lot. Hi guys, Bye. enjoy your new house. Oh shit, this guy looks like a wolf <laughs> Yes, he does. Mizuki got his haunted house. That man's about to make himself a ghost. I really want him to fall out of the chair sometimes. <sighs> oh god, he's a ghost. It's so weird. Now you really look like Lucas. That's on the sun and bone hell. Oh, there she is. You're not weirded out here, Corey? You're not weirded out here, Corey. And there's a... And there's a woman with bones in our house. Did, did nobody care about this? Yeah, they came in the backyard. And he's playing soccer ball. <laughs> oh, Cecil's here too. Hi, Cecil. Oh, y'all are weird. Think about it, the best. Poor. Thank you, anyway. They were alone. You just brought her to life like five minutes ago. What? <laughs> Jesus. Okay, you just. <laughs> Oh, he's not a Oh, person. now he's a person. I was like, right, humans. <laughs> Did she wave about him? About him? A really good maid. Yes. Better than any maid we ever hired. And cruel twist of fate, you end up in a haunted house, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, okay, we know about that part. I can handle this. Why, why are you uncomfortable? Are you uncomfortable in my house? Yeah, come couple because Bon Hill keeps walking around with a party symbol. In the woohoo symbol. Oh my god, Kyoshi! Guys, I'm gonna need you to lose some muscle mass. Byron likes these surprise age ups, like they're his favorite. Surprise, you should age up your head. Yeah, for some reason Dirk didn't age up on his own, so here's old man Dirk. Clean It's funny, nothing else changed. Like, you know, some of them start looking old, he looks exactly the same. He's like, I'm the only kid. Doing homework in my area? She was. Oh! And you're like, oh, that's a good idea. I'm happy that you got food. Madison! Madison's here, everybody. Party can start. Like, everybody come eat our food. You don't live here anymore. I wish you go to bed. Yeah, he's asleep. Which he's not even tired right here. Your sons are here. Madison's like, where'd you get that from, Mom? She's not our last redheaded. True is, but she'll be the last redhead in this family we play with. Very pretty. She's a cute old lady. First generation, second generation, third generation, fourth generation, fifth generation. We went time. straight back to bed. So did oh, Shiny. Oh, the worst. We talked about like changing the house so that it's more of a party atmosphere, and then the rooms on the top floor would be museums, quote unquote. Because we start putting up paintings in each of the rooms, but. We ran out of room, like Natalie's wall was full. I'm like, well, if Jensen's wall is going to go in there, then it's going to be too much, like Jensen's yeah, stuff. Yeah, started getting really crowded. So, yeah. Ended up moving on to a really big lot that kind of looks like a compound now. Started on Friday with just the outsides and stuff. Night one, this is what we have so far. I really love his pathways, which they look really good from the sky. They really do. They look very clean. We have Reed's building in the front. Natalie's, but we're gonna change that because I'm not really feeling the stone. Madison. <laughs> it looks like a bar. And then we did a little bit more work yesterday. We changed Natalie's house completely. And I think it looks so much better. Looks nice. It looks really good. I love the windows. I love the little nook things. Good. And the style, the coloring and everything. Awesome. Madison's windows and everything. And I think it came out really nice. Mm -hmm. You always see the true test of if it looks good or not when we come back. Yeah, and if you still like it. Yeah, it's basically the floor and walls right now. We haven't really gotten into the inside, so we're doing reeds first. It's really coming together. And then this is reeds, because Byron wanted to start with reed, because he's, I guess, Byron's Why favorite. Why not is the question. <laughs> we wanted to get to Marvel. That's yes. pretty much what it was. But it was Byron's idea to kind of set up, like, catty corners mm -hmm. for each patriarch that we're going to follow. Right. We're going to put mine and Byron's wall together, so that that's why there's, like, graves just in the middle of the yard. <laughs> If we did the gym theme, because that's Reed, we have kind of exercise equipment everywhere, some yoga mats, a rock wall, even though he never got to do a rock wall. So far, we only have the left wall actually together, together with like the diplomas and each kid and their birth certificate, that kind of stuff. We have been trying to figure this out for so, a couple days. Yeah, it's still not fully on the shelf, but. That's actually not in the right level, I don't think. It's really at least it's in the air, halfway there. Let's just float them all in the air. 
That would really freak the Sims out. Big right. two, now we think we got it. Yeah, that'll work in the end, Sim. The elevator of love. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Oh God, yeah. Look what Byron did. The memorial wall. It's like a, a tribute to Reed. Yo, Byron's having way too much fun with this. What? Y'all see the little robotic station that the we got? Station, and the this. huge frog. Oh, and then that was huge when we got it. Yes. You can get her a rocking chair. Oh, you can put it right in front of the picture of Marvel on the rocking chair. Right. And that is adorable. That's so cute. That's cute. <laughs> not like it's really going to grow anyway. Byron and his friends are about to start a new D&D &D quest. It's campaign. Campaign, sorry. <laughs> and he's like super excited, which I'm happy. It's just he keeps no, randomly funny. talking about it. I forgot what the campaign's called, but it takes place all within Waterdeep. And if you know D and D, Waterdeep is like the big one of the big cities, if not the biggest, maybe. I'm still new to it. So we're all talking about our characters. We we did like a little short campaign, me and one other person. So we're all really excited to start this. Uh, my voice and everything. You... Oh my god, the voice! I can't. I suppose you have for it, so I'm like. What do you mean? Or something like Sarah just pizza and be like I'm like watching Dateline into like whatever Keith Morris is saying and then here's Byron like what are you doing? What is going on in there? <laughs> We're gonna go see Hazuki, who has lived in his haunted house for a couple days now. I think you have glasses like me. Mm, look at me while I'm talking to you though. <laughs> are you asking me out? I'm single in case you're wondering and I'm willing to get weird. Alright, what did you bring our friend into? Spectre Sprinkle from being near a playful Spectre. Whatever that Spectre did, it sure feels good. Maybe Spectres aren't so bad after all. He's uh, just gonna sparkle? I feel like he's like yes. the best. Who the hell's Bernard? He's gonna track down ghosts to this lot. Maybe oh wow, there. that's cool. So we can be able to meet just random ghosts? Mm. Bernard's sad. I walked through the wall. <laughs> Bernard, did you freeze it up? That would be cool if you could ask them how they died. Like how you're running to here. That's creepy. What just on our door? How what was that? I don't know, and it freaked him out too. Something just knocked on the Oh door. my god, Azumi, I'm so sorry. He's fine. That was nothing. It was the wind. I'm kind of curious who he's kicking the soccer ball with. That's me, it's right. Who's he kicking the soccer ball with? In the middle of the night. <laughs> Late yeah. night visits. That's what he's got going on. He's hungry now. You hear that, right? Yes. Yeah, sorry. It's too creepy. I'm leaving. Move it to a haunted house, she says. It's <laughs> clever, Hello there. The name's Ghidri. Oh, uh, God! Oh, uh, no, we're not flirting. We're not flirting. Stop. Well, you're a guy. You can flirt with me, but that's about it. <laughs> I want to become paranormal. Congratulations. Now look at you. You're practically burning with spiritual energy. I knew there was something special about you. That's why I got this here paranormal investigator's license with your name on it. We've also had him go on two blind dates. One was horrible. That was a jerk. He was so, they were arguing by the end of it. Second blind date, he did pretty good. We kind of like him. Sarah but, doesn't like his hair. Look, I grew up a blonde. In video games and TV shows, they tend to make blondes with like this gold color hair. At least back then, now they've gotten better. So this guy has like gold hair. So I was like, if we pick him, we are changing that hair color. His house randomly came with a uh, candle station. I thought it'd be cool to try to make one. I feel like touching it would hurt. <laughs> See? Like that. Oh my god, that would have been perfect like for Halloween. On another blind date, which it's weird. So this is actually Ocean's brother-in-law. Is that weird if he marries Suzuki? I don't know. I mean, funny. it would be like you're marrying your cousin's brother-in-law. On two of our dates, we have caught Bobby, who's married to Coral, out with other women. Technically, there was four people at this table. Yeah, well, Byron had to send him away once because he kept trying to butt into our relationship. I think he has a That might be it. Oh, exercise the lot. I do like the little blue screen that it gives you. Don't worry, folks. Stand back. I got this. What's happening? Get these things out of here. <laughs> get these things out of here. You're such a mess. Got some stuff on the floor. Here we gotta get rid of. We gotta go. a nice little apartment. Nice little apartment. That person <laughs> doesn't care apparently about the ghost. You got a lot of ghosts here. And a smelly baby. <laughs> Problem. You can't be flirty doing this stuff, sir. <laughs> oh no, that man's scared. Look, you don't want to be here. It's an apartment. You can come back to my house. We have parties. It's cool. Guy named Gidry. Little hella cooks. Man, it's thundering. That doesn't seem like you're supposed to be doing it. Oh god. <laughs> Someone... They can't wait till we leave. 
Ah. He did not want to leave. Yeah. Oh. oh. Alright, we're gonna need the big guns. I'm creating a seance circle. He's still terrified. I don't know if he'll move. Like right. You're not giving him much confidence. Alright, it's not helping you. Oh, God. Stop running in there with the ghost. <laughs> People are gonna murder each other, so. There we go. Nice. So, from his first job, he got Dahlia. Apparently, you could talk to her and she'll help you decrease your fear. Even though it's also a cursed object. I thought he got a cursed object. I was like, oh, that's nice. That's the first piece of thing that we'll put in his uh, memorial. What you get scared for? Yes. All right, can we not talk about his memorial yet? That's what he got scared of. He got some Uber Eats Wally's Southern Barbecue, and all oh, these ribs were amazing. I had my first. I had my first ever double baked potato with good dinner. Nani's family, Coral's family, and Mariana. He does have the best picture. Look at that. Like it's just such a good picture. It's such a prim and proper picture. I love it. This is how we're gonna do each family group. I really am excited. Moving on to Natalie. Right now we have this wall of all of her paintings. Mm -hmm. The back wall of all her paintings. All these urns are gonna be the end of us. Byron just tried to do this like three times and it kept sending us to Reed's wall. It's like, oh, you want it here? I think Jensen gave the same problems. Jensen's remember, tur kept turning into a grave. outside. <laughs> Right there. It's done. Just walk away. This is Jensen's wall, and it's a little weird. <laughs> tree in because Aiden liked botany, and I liked those trees. The problem that we have with Jensen is we're following two of his kids who are going to have their own wall with their kids. Cats. Cats. No cats. Way cats. And his shoe sign because he couldn't wear shoes in the house. There's a doctor thing that Kyle. Kyle oh, yes! Doing. Very nice. Yeah, that is cute. It's like a little doctor set like her dad. We have a table that Jensen loved. That was his little bench outside. And then we have Natalie's pictures of him when he was a kid. Very nice. So yeah, if you want to take a load off, come to Jensen's house. There you go. Oh, our dear old Mariana's pregnant again by that orange man. That orange man. Who never gets to come to parties anymore. Yeah. Family dance time. I was just being good friends with Julianne. And That's Julianne. good. That was a good reputation. Since y'all live together. That's good. Oh. Oh, who cursed? I think it was Molly. <laughs> I know you don't like strangers. Why don't you go to these bathrooms and we'll go get your kids? How did y'all become good friends? Y'all aren't even near each other. Hey, good dancing. <laughs> hey, you too. You're a pretty cool person. <laughs> uh, Why is he always freaking out at all of our parties? Woo, Molly. There's Molly. She looks angry. Yeah, hey, Molly. I was like, what do you have, Molly? Okay, there's not enough. Just grab cake and go. Oh, so y'all, I thought last week was gonna be the last weekend that we got to see Derek. Oh, and, and the rest of the Munchitos. I forgot that this weekend Cheyenne is aging up. Yes, we invited him, although Byron says he's gonna go on one more date. Yeah. I'm like, so this guy's meeting the family, but he still has to go on one more date? He's a little backwards there, sir. He hasn't crossed the finish line yet. <laughs> he's ahead. He's like ahead by like a few miles, but good trip. You don't know. Like flirts with one of the brothers or something, then it's all right. Automatic disqualification. There you go. Oh, 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 oh. Really? Very cute. Oh, old lady. Just keeping your black hair. <laughs> he tried to ask for an autograph. Which his hair finally changed. He thought he was gonna escape us. I like I'm Cheyenne's. So black. Yes, I like. That is true because Cheyenne's are gray. Yeah. I like Cheyenne's color gray. Yeah. That's a nice color. Yeah. Where's Derek? I have not paid attention. Derek to is inside in the middle of the dance floor. Angel is Derek. There is Derek. Oh, there's you stalking Derek. Yeah, look, like, there's me and Derek. Look, like, it's me and Derek. Oh, weird. We just signed him up for his last date. I think it's pretty clear. He's gonna be the one hook up the Grim Reaper. The so Ghost Hunter and Grim Reaper hook up. Then they have Magic Kid. That's how magic gets introduced into the realm of Sims 4. <laughs> Such a mess. You can't write it better. He's doing a seance with his new boyfriend. Apparently there's like a face. See right there. That's so weird. I have never seen that before. For the ceremony, we gotta cleanse the house of all the evil spirits. Yeah, because one almost scared his poor Desmond away. Too, right? Yes, I saw that too. What was that? Y'all, the power went out and then something like ran. Yeah, like we saw some flash or something here. It looked like a ghost, but it was like black. But something just flew by our window in the in the the outside in the real world. Freaked you out. Yes. You play this game too much. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh my God! Wow. Look what she named the first kid. 
Honda. Ariana had herself some twins. Look at her. Somebody besides someone in Madison's line had twins. Me and Burns did our wall. It's so cute. Looks good. I know the floor hurts your eyes. It really does have a lot. But we worked on Madison's room. We got all the little musical instruments going on. Now, none of these are their personal instruments because those still are with the girls. The horse that she made for like the day that she had the woodworking table. We're gonna um, raise Jeffrey. And... We're not raising Jeffrey. It is not happening. Not I do sorry. feel bad that he's gone. I feel bad that he got cold. And I also feel bad that we had them break up. I have very bad second thoughts about it. And it's really sad, because that's the girl's dad. Fix it. No. Ocean's favorite thing to do. Oh, you have the same hair your sister had. There's a little Wanda. Welcome to the family you train. Your, you got your dad's hair. He came out of his home earlier. So it was tech my puzzle pieces. He Early. On the puzzle pieces, just it, because dust. Yeah, so it like dripped over him, and there were like puzzle pieces on his back, and he was trying to bite the towel off. He didn't understand why it was there. So we'll see you guys again on Wednesday for my name change anniversary. It's 12 years, super excited. Everybody has a great start to their week, and we will see you guys Wednesday. I'm shaking my head, Mars, right now. Yes, you are.